little bit different angles to top roll off of. So when you're when you're setting up your top roll on the table, there's there's two things that are really important. And the first thing is is making the person reach for you. And uh, You want to you wanna accomplish this by being super high up with your angle and, and trying to climb to the highest spot possible in the, like where the match is concerned. So a lot of times people are coming just straight up in their post angle. And just a slight alternative to this is it's my belief that an, a, high, a higher angle than just straight up is actually... A little bit of kicking back of the wrist and a little bit of supination. So, so a straight post is one thing, but a post that's actually supinating and kicking back slightly is, is even harder to reach. So a neat way to train this uh, is so set your cable up so you're doing like external rotation, loop a belt around your thumb, have the running end go right over your knuckle. So then at the table, you're forced to really, really, really kick back and, and supinate. So this is going to help get you that spot where the person's forced to hold on to you. Uh, another thing is, is um, you know, so often people are pulling internally. And this is great to pin a person. But one of the first things you really want to do is you want to make sure that you get access to that person's fingertips. So again, same angle, similar wrap, okay? But this time, instead of going this way, you're going to go over the back of the hand. Just spin that a bit. There we go, okay? So it's, it's, it's like you do most of your bell work, but this time it's with, uh, with external rotation. So that should really, really hit somebody's fingers that's trying to come at you and cut. Hope this helps.